Hi, you cats and kittens. Welcome back to Minecraft Earth featuring the Jolly Llama. So we are going to be building a llama pen for my single one and only llama. This is the build plate you unlock when you reach level 10. I think so. I believe so. I have four build plates. I have the level 15 one, which you'll see in another video. So we are currently just going to clean up the entirety of the area. As you can see, there is a mob of me somewhere down there, which I thought later on I had destroyed. I should have figured out a way to keep the water from kind of fully disappearing for two seconds. But it's okay, I get buckets and as you can see I kept having issues with the placement of the plate and sometimes it just like floats away into the beyond so hopefully uh, the devs are very like diligent diligent aware of the subreddits for Minecraft Earth and are constantly talking to us there, which is super great. Oh, look, you can actually see my tree and my tree skirt. Too bad you can't actually see the whole tree. I should probably pop a picture in, or you can follow me on Instagram, link down below, and you'll see the wonderful Doctor Who themed Christmas tree, which I currently have the lights flashing. So we're still just gonna like kind of clean up all the dirt and as you can see every time like I move something or change something it the water just like either spreads or disappears not the greatest thing ever I just want a clean plate for my llama like I wish these things didn't get this deep this is insane as how deep it is of course I totally fill it I do have another build plate that I'm using only for the weekly and daily challenges of fill plate blank 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 like fill it this much or put this many blocks or put this type of block here i'm using a plate specifically for that it's filled with gravel sand and dirt as of right now so whenever i have a flower thing i'm just gonna put it there and i'm almost done look at me be almost done almost done Woo! Now we get to go back and fill the whole thing. The whole thing. Doop -ba doop boop boop. And it's filling quite fast. Oh, awesome. Totally forgot to mention this while we were decomposing or decomposing. Uh removing everything. Is if you take two fingers and you just keep kind of swiping along the screen, it automatically picks up the blocks if you don't have precision on really great at clearing a plate super great like if you're just like I need to clear this because there is no take all button or destruction button Mojang give us a destruction button like we do in tap out where you could destroy your entire town and start over I would love a button like that for a build plate It'd be so much easier Hopefully the Jolly Llama loves his home. We will find out later on in the video. And as I'm watching this, I'm like, I'm missing spots. Like, there's holes, which is why I kept, probably kept hearing the llama fall into the water as I was building this. Like, I just kept hearing the sploosh sound and the murp sploosh, murp sploosh. And I'm just like, um, I thought I fenced my llama. All this is going to take for... I forgot how long this took. So, this built, like, to, de to take everything out of there and to put everything back in there while waiting for buckets. Good old buckets. It took an hour-long break in between. But with the amount that I recorded, recorded or screen recorded for this it took about a half hour which isn't bad i'm not an epic minecraft builder severely just <laughs> that's not a phrase i 
severely suggest, that's the word I needed, suggest, going to Minecraft Earth subreddit. I don't, I will try to remember to link it down below. You are going to see some amazing people and builds and also like all bugs constantly. All known bugs constantly. I'm just trying to fill it in. I end up here is where I decided I wanted to build a moat around. So the llama has a smaller pen, kind of more of like a cramped pen. Something PETA would definitely be angry about. But then, you know, PETA also gets angry for people having pets. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, as much good as they do, they also do a lot of destructive or have a lot of destructive behavior beside, behind some of the amazing things they've done. Oh no. I, I kept having it I kept having an issue where the dirt just wouldn't like want to place there. Or I couldn't see what I was doing, which is why I didn't want to like lose the water, but I thought I grabbed the two source blocks that were on this build or this build plate. I guess I grabbed more, or there was one more, there was a couple more source blocks, because I definitely grabbed this source block here, and then the one that was further down. And then I accidentally made the whole thing disappear because I killed the actual source block that I thought I had originally removed, so I come back with my buckets of two, because I don't want to lose a full bucket. Apparently you can get the buckets of water, like if you have empty buckets in your hot bar, you can get buckets of water when you do the um, tappables that have like a little water patch in them. You'll get a bucket of water or you can get a bucket of water. So I'm going to keep my eye open on that and keep buckets in my uh, hot bar from now on. So I decided to do this and then I remember the only way to get grass is to put a grass block in. So I could get grass for Mr. Llama, I'm gonna call it a mister, I don't know. If I get another llama, it's gonna be a missus, and then my llama friend won't be alone. Because I don't want my llama friend to be alone, because my llama friend deserves to have a friend. And this was like, this was my big brain moment, like, yes! I'm gonna get grass! Nope. Which I'm currently working on a build plate where I have a farm, but I really don't want to, like, collapse the jungle build plate so I don't know exactly what I'm gonna be doing about that I might just add it to the llama if you can see how I'm doing this nothing with fences to have posts I'm gonna build like a nice little what are they called a veranda the little top things with the slats verandas verandas There's, there's gotta, I know this is early access, but this, there's gotta be an easier way to build. I mean, you could swipe to make the building move so you don't have to walk around it in its entirety as long as it's not filling the entire screen. But I wish there's like a way, I mean, there is with precision, with the precision little like hit, but I also really don't like precision at the like, at the same time, I love the precision, and I also don't like it. Just because sometimes you want to do something more than what you are... Like, you want to hit something, and with precision, you have to physically be over it to hit it. So, so far, our little house for Mr. Llama is becoming very nice. And look, he has a house! I think he's happy. I hope he's happy. We'll find out towards the end of this video whether or not my Jolly Llama is a happy llama. Oh, I was trying to figure out what I wanted to use for lights. I want lanterns. Because I think lanterns would be insanely adorable on this. Instead of torches. Like having them right at the edge of the... Maybe I could do it in the all four corners if I figure out how to like rig it so it works like that. I gotta figure out if we can get like... Sea, not sea lanterns, but the little lanterns that we have in Minecraft that look like little house lanterns. 
I haven't seen a build with one of those yet. So hopefully, fingers crossed, that is something we get. I mean, I truly think we're going to get everything that's in Minecraft eventually. And if we do get, like, the bees that we just got in the 1.5... 1.5... 1. 1.15 update. I want to create a little beehive. Oh, look! I forgot I put flowers! I recorded this like three days ago and I've already forgotten what I did. But look! Oh my god! He does! He looks so happy! Look at my little jolly llama! He's so happy, but he's also so lonely and he's a friend. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I am Zombie Kitty. Thank you and have a good night.